सो हाई गाइस आई एम बैक अगेन विथ अनदर अमेजिंग वीडियो सो गाइस आई रिमेंबर यू गाइस रिक्वेस्टेड मी टू ट्राई दिस सो यस दैट्स वाई वी आर हेयर सो गाइस टूडे वी गॉन ऑन बॉक्स दिस कॉस्मिक पैकेजेस फ्रॉम हैश ब्रो एंड गाइस दिस इज नॉट अ नॉर्मल कॉस्मिक पैकेजेस इट्स अ कॉस्मिक पैकेजेस डब्ल्यू वन जीरो फाइव आर टू एफ सो यस गाइस यू गाइस रिक्वेस्टेड मी टू ट्राई दिस एंड दैट्स वाई वी आर हेयर सो यस गाइस आई एम गॉन ऑन बॉक्स इट एंड आई एम वेरी एक्साइटेड अबाउट इट आई होप यू आर टू सो लेट मी नो योर एक्साइटमेंट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड इफ यू आर न्यू योर मेक श्योर टू सब्सक्राइब बिकॉज देर इज मोर एक्साइटमेंट टू कम सो मेक श्योर यू डू दैट इन अफ अबाउट दिस गाइस लेट्स ओपन दिस बॉक्स एंड लेट्स टेक आउट अर बे एंड लेट्स सी हाउ इट इज So guys, we have unboxed our bay, and here are the things we got into the box. So very first, we get some Hasbro copyright document, which we actually don't care. So here it goes, and then we have a Hasbro user manual. Also, we don't care. So here it goes, and then guys, we have a Ripcord launcher rights pin. Ah, uh, we do care about it, but sadly, it has to go away, right? So I'm gonna keep it away. So here it goes, and there is the battle online card, which I don't think so relevant anymore. But still, if you wanna scan the code, go ahead, be my guest. So yeah, here it is. Now, guys, here's the main thing: key tool and a Beyblade. I actually don't need the key tool, but it's all right. So yeah, guys, this is Cosmic Pegasus W105R2F. I am really excited, and I don't know what to say. Let me show you a bit closer look. So guys, I hope you can see that how amazing it looks. Let me know in the comment section, guys. I personally think that it looks sick trust me i mean it it's not having two or three part fusion wheel but it looks sick take a look guys how crazy this looks amazing right so guys let's talk about the individual parts real quick and let's see what we got here so guys let me take out all the parts to show you what we got here so we get this pegasus face bolt uh, with a red print on it so that is that is cool that is cool nice then we get this guys a uh, pegasus energy ring so this is pr practically similar to what we get in takara tommy but with a different color so you can see the difference in color right so that is there obviously so let me compare the energy ring one more time so this is what it looks like totally opaque and even different color so there's a slight difference in color obviously then guys this is the fusion wheel from hasbro and this is the fusion wheel from takatom you can see the difference in size this one is bigger obviously and this one is smaller we can see that totally right and guys even this is very hollow at the bottom it's not even any hollow it, i mean it, it is missing some part of metal but it is what it is right but this is more hollow this is real bad so i'm not sure how this is going to do but <laughs> there's one more thing like it has a paint which actually mimics pc frame so it does not have a pc frame even pc frame cannot fit on it so that's why they painted it so so if we put a pc frame on takara Tommy so that's what it it resembles here so it's not the same thing but it is what it is all right so so for the sake of comparison let's compare the weight so guys let's weigh Takara Tommy fusion wheel first so it is 41 grams crazy guys amazing crazy now time for hash bro damn it it's 32 grams it's like 8 9 grams lighter that is a lot guys that is a lot to take honestly so that is hash bro so let me assemble it and then let's weigh the whole bay and let's see how light it is compared to Takara Tommy so this is hell of a light to be i'm not sure how this is going to do in battle because i really have doubts there because it's very light guys come for a metal fury bay it's, it's really light i'm not sure how it's going to do up against the other metal fury bays out there so guys let's weigh takara tommy bay it's 51 grams wow that is a lot of weight trust me now time for ash bro let's see how much this guy weighs 38.25 grams that is a lot lighter almost 13 grams lighter guys that is a lot i'm not sure how this bay is going to do so i have my doubts there and compared to that let me weigh storm pegasus storm weighs 36 grams and galaxy weighs 35 grams and this guy weighs 38 grams so it's slightly heavier than these two fellows but but a lot lighter compared to this fellow so i'm not sure how this is going to do but we have to test it out so let me bring out the stadium and and let's try how it does so guys our stadium is set up and we are ready so i'm going to do the test launch first so here we go let it rip So aggression is pretty much, and that is expected from R2F. So aggression is pretty good, and it's controllable too. So the fusion wheel really should be very balanced because it is controllable. So that's that's the case here. I'm really happy about it. So let me let me do one more test spin, real quick. Here we go. So yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Not bad. Not bad. I'm happy about it. So yeah, that's good. Now it's time for some battles. So I'm ready ready for it. So. We gonna start with Storm Pegasus. Let's see if it can defeat Storm Pegasus. So let me stop this very real quick. And guys, I think this fusion wheel is not a uh, metal. This is not a metal shine. I think this is a paint, silver paint. So I believe the paint is gonna chip off at some point. So I will try not to do many battles. But for today, we gonna do it. 
So let's start with Storm Pegasus. So here we go. Here goes Storm Pegasus. Time for this guy. Here we go. And Storm Pegasus has more stamina for because it's it's not R two F, it's R F, and that is also worn out. So that's why uh, Storm Pegasus has more stamina. So if if this bait does not attack, Storm will win. Trust me. So let's see how this goes. And that's gonna look very bad for this guy. So that's a draw. Let's try again. Let's try again. No issues. So here goes Storm, guys. Here goes this guy. Yeah, so aggression is a lot. And since R2, oh, crazy guys! I was not expecting it. Obviously, it's a heavy bay compared to Storm, but no worries. Awesome job. Next, let's try Galaxy Pegasus. Let's see if it can defeat Galaxy. I would love to find out. So yeah, goes Galaxy, guys. No time for this guy. Here we go. Heavy hits against Galaxy, guys. Holy moly, guys! That's crazy, guys. That's crazy. So yeah, it defeated Galaxy without any issue. Let's try Cosmic. I'm sure it will have a lot of fun with Cosmic. So guys, here goes Cosmic. No time for this guy. Here we go. Oh, amazing! So it has activated the FD. Let's see if it can do any good against Cosmic because Cosmic is a lot heavy, and I don't think so. Its attacks gonna work much. But pretty good. I mean, for a bay or that light, it is doing pretty good with cosmic. Cosmic hasn't knocked it out, so that's a lot. Holy moly! Draw with the cosmic? You kidding me? Let's try again. So here we go, guys. Let's see if this guy can actually win. Damn! Come on, cosmic! You cannot lose. Guys, this bay is light, but I don't know how it is defeating Cosmic. I don't know, seriously. Okay, guys, let's try one more time. Here we go. Here we go. What? You gotta be kidding me, guys. Now, guys, we're gonna try some 4D against it. So let me try Chris Kickness. I don't know if it's gonna defeat, but let's try. So here we go, guys. Now time for this guy. Here we go. So I'm not expecting it to win against Chris Kickness, but let's see. Because Chris Kingness has a metal face bolt, so it will be a really hard to push this guy. But it's all right, it's all right. Let me let me give it one more shot. So here we go. Here we go. Pretty good attack. Sadly, it wasn't enough to defeat this guy, but it did okay according to me. I think not that bad, not that bad. All right, all right, all right, big fella. So yeah, Chris Kingness is a hard guy to beat. Let's try Death Quartz Gotal. Let's see if it can beat this guy. Here goes Quartz Gotal. Time for this guy. Here we go. Oh damn! It made Quartz Gotal go crazy, guys. Let's see if it can pull a win. Sadly, it cannot. Let's try one more time. One more time. Then here we go. Time for this guy. Here we go. Oh damn! <laughs> so, so yeah, guys, for Takara Tommy 4D base, this base not a really good way to go with. Let's try Very Aries. I'm not sure how this is gonna go. Here we go. Holy moly, guys! Takara Tommy 4D base will crush this base like nothing. So yeah, my verdict is this is good for collection. This is good to play with a uh, Hasbro Metal Fury base, but not with 4D. So yeah, that's what I feel about it because it's a lot lighter. Sometimes due to RTF, it might surprise you, but mostly it won't. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's my thought on this. Let me know your thoughts in comment section. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna see you guys in another video. But for now, guys, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna see you guys in another video. So guys, till then, stay safe and happy blading.